my day usually starts really early in the morning, around five o'clock. I'm Sergeant Kanisha Bowie. I'm a 31 Bravo, military police with the U.S. Army. I felt like I just wanted to make a difference and do something that I could be proud of. It would give me something that even if I did want to get out later, it, I could transfer also to be a civilian police officer also. I went through basic training first, and then I went through AIT, Advanced Individual Training. I learned how to arrest or apprehend somebody. I learned how to pull over, um, get somebody a ticket. I learned how to investigate. I learned how to um, list fingerprints, like everything in AIT you learn in those 10 weeks. I'm always out patrolling. I'm always out doing something, walking patrols, patrolling in my vehicle. When we're guarding the gate, good morning, sir. We're checking IDs, making sure that nobody suspicious is coming through the gate. Can you the road on your back window, please? So it's not a boring job at all, ever. Three one, bro. Return station reference, Rainbow Card. Once I got to my unit, I went to a protective service detail school. The protective service detail school helped me on my deployment because that's literally all I did was guard a VIP. Who's in area one? While I was deployed, um, I took advantage of the tuition assistance. I did a lot of my classes online. It was just easier for me. Wait for backup, wait for MPI, wait for traffic, wait for, I'll come out there and just help you out. Am I good? The degree that I'm pursuing now is a business leadership and management. Exercise, one, two, three. One, After one, I deployed, two, three, uh, I went through one, deployment two, three, and then I three, came back to do MPI, which is Military Police Investigation School. And also I went to WOC, which is Warrior Leaders course. I really enjoyed that school because it taught me how to be a leader and what a good leader is. Joining the Army, it's, it's brought a lot more confidence in me because you're put in certain situations that you have to be confident, especially as military police. Return station reference. If I were to leave the Army because of the courses in the schools that I've had so far, I could be a civilian police officer. I could be a investigator. Um, I could be um, a part of the Secret Service with my um, protective service detail um, school that I went to. I could do that also. It's exciting some days, so you never know, and it's different every day. Sometimes it can be challenging, but I like what I do and I love my job, so it's a good day every day. All right, three, one, good copy, and roll.